All right, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Send the Frankie's MTB Vlog. All right, today we are it's Thursday, so as I mentioned earlier this week, we're gonna be back. Um, we're gonna <clears throat> we're gonna definitely uh, scout out the Mount Wilson area, especially the uh, the JBL side of things for now, and then uh, in the future we're gonna definitely. Uh, start scanning out the dark side but the dark side is like you know <clears throat> it's like a 5,000 feet climb up or something like that it's, it's pretty insane so we're gonna try and work our way up progress our way up into that uh, area so we can uh, we so we don't have to shuttle since I'm on the e-bike so today we're gonna do uh, two of the runs last Monday we did El Prieto and uh, that was just like the first climb and today we're gonna climb even further. We're gonna do Sunset Ridge and then down to El Prieto. And then maybe next Monday, we might do the full on this side. So that uh, is one extra trail added. I forget the name, I'll put the name here. Um, so with that, hope you guys uh, will tune into these uh, series. Uh, and uh, hope you guys enjoy these series and I'll take you guys across this uh, vast uh, mountain range. So there's also something that I've been thinking about uh, recently that, uh, you know, ever since I started the channel, I wasn't very clear on the direction of the channel. That's really mainly because I wasn't really clear on what I was doing. Um, you know, when I first started, I was just, you know, using my nickname as the channel name, but then, you know, I was still missing a theme or a direction or what you guys can learn from it. And uh, last night I've been thinking about this really recently because I've been progressing um, and then, you know, my passion really is uh, riding mountain bikes, so I really want to just get better and better and better. But, you know, um, I started late uh, mountain biking, and I think um, one of the ways to catch up is just riding, right? Constant riding. And, and everybody knows if you're constant riding, there's no way you can ride. I mean, there's a way you can ride analog bikes every day, but the amount of progress and the amount of um, area that you can cover is limited on a mountain bike and you know one of the theories that I, I, I found myself discovering through getting an e-bike is that you can progress a lot faster with an e-bike that's my theory so what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to prove to everybody or not prove to everybody I'm just pretty much documenting if that's the case so hope you guys can learn something from that and um, right now the challenge is still at uh, 365 days um, I'm I am at a hunt this should be 107 and uh, I'm on 107 days of continuous riding and then we'll see how much I can I am progressing after 365 days and uh, hope you guys enjoy all the videos and if you guys have questions if you guys want to know where to ride uh, blah 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 and all that stuff I'm, you know I'm just constantly uploading videos every day and um, just showing you the progress and showing you what the EMTBs can do so I'm gonna switch the channel into EMTB progression daily I think somewhere along the lines of that that's the slogan so that hope you guys will enjoy we'll see you guys up top or somewhere in the middle when we're resting and uh, and we'll have fun on the way down. See you in a bit. Woo. All right, guys. Probably the more gruesome uh, climbs. It's just gonna be a road climb up. Very probably a very boring climb. Uh, that's why it's a hard. Uh, a lot of people just shuttle this because climbing up on these roads not the ideal climb for a mountain bike but for a EMTB it's doable but uh the biggest challenge is battery conservation right how much energy you have left for the downhill so we're gonna do this full eco and hopefully we'll survive when we get to the top of the hill or top of the mountain I should say it's not a hill it's a mountain all right drizzling it's a little bit not intense rain but a little rain in uh 
middle of August never hurts. Feels good, but holy cow, this uh, climb is not easy on Eco. It's boring since this uh, road climb it's all on pavement. But uh, I'm hoping I mean, from the YouTube videos online that it's worth it. It is really worth it. It looks so much fun going down. So long. And this uh, connects to El Prieto, which is pretty awesome. You just have to make this climb. All right, guys, ready to drop in. This is Sunset Ridge Trail, pretty historic. Uh, make sure all my suspension's open. All right, it looks very exposed from all the YouTube videos that I've been watching. So, right off the bat. Don't look at the exposure. <laughs> That's the key to exposure. Just don't look at it. That's the key to mountain biking, right? The one thing you don't want to look at is the object you want to avoid. All right, guys, I'm not going to go too fast. First time, I don't know what's coming up. But it already looks so much fun. If you notice here, uh, mostly rollable drops. Nothing to the point where you need to. Unless you're doing a high speed, then you need to drop off. time Whew. so the people come across like that maybe saw them do a drop here uh tommy and them hope you guys have seen this <laughs> uh only thing i can describe to you is much more scary in person gopro is infamous for not for having a gopro effect <laughs> wow all right i'm almost out of battery
Oh, this is the really steep one they took too. It's so rutted out. Holy shit. You can come through. That's fine. Easier for you to come through than <laughs> dodging us together. All right, Jesus, I gotta rest my hands. I'm on the brakes constantly. <sighs> Whew. Let's see how much we have to go. Holy shit. Holy shit, guys. Oh, fuck. That. Oh, oh. All right. Now you need to cut my bars. Woo. Woo. <laughs> that was sketch that was a sketchy moment <laughs> oh, that was right off the edge Whew. guys I also had my bell um, and I totally forgot my bell there's a lot of hikers here so I really need to remember to bring my bell bell was in my car found it and I forgot it Woo! End of Sunset Ridge. Awesome. All right. Now it's time for us to hike to El Prier, Prieto. We made it to uh, El Prieto Trail. Um, so this is the second series of, on Monday when I came here. I just climbed up here. I'm gonna come out here and scope, I think is Merrill. I think that's what it's called. I keep forgetting. I have to look on Trail Forks. But we're about to drop into El Prieto. If you have a chance, head over to my Patreon. I, um, I will have the extended cuts of today's video on Patreon uh, of both Sunset and El Prieto. So, with, hopefully, you guys head over there, subscribe to my uh, Patreon. It's a dollar a month or three dollars a month for the extended cuts, a dollar a month for the early access. So, get on that, support me. That would be awesome. All right, about to drop in. See you guys in a bit. All right, dropping in El Prieto. Oops, stupid. Always forget something. Part of my progression, right? You always gotta forget. You gotta remember. There's a whole bunch of stuff to do to remember and on biking. Always so much stuff to remember. Ooh. Creative line. Right. Last time I couldn't get over this hump. 
<laughs> that was dumb. <laughs> Rock right in the middle. Let's see how fun this trail is. Turns here. Ha! Stuck. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Yeah, I totally forgot it on the bike. I'm, so, I'm on the car. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Thank you. Whew. All right. So it's important to bring your bell. I forgot mine. Pretty idiot move because there's a lot of hikers on this trail. Um, honestly. I'm starting to suspect this is not a good trail to ride for the weekends because weekends got to be packed full of people because this is so close to, you know, Pasadena, Altadena, like so close to downtown, like, you know, which is where big populations are. Probably not the best to come on weekends, but if you do, you got to come early. Weekdays are probably best. That. Yeah, I'm good. <laughs> Thank you guys. Don't want a full stop there.
Oh, that was done. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, falling hard. Just falling over on the rocks. Ouch. I'm doing worse than the first time. I think the first time I was running a little bit faster speed. This time today, I think I'm a little bit more tired because of the climb. So you gotta be mindful when we come here. And then when we do the San Nero, you're gonna be super tired by the end. By the time you get to here. And you gotta be careful when you're tired. Because I don't think it helped. Yesterday's ride was pretty insane. Woo. 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 Some exposure. Holy drop. That was a holy drop. Right over that rock. That's why we hate. That's why we hate. Uh, what you call it? Switchbacks. Ah. That was dumb. All right. Whew. All right, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Mount Wilson's exploration, e-biking progression. Woo! Always tired when you come out of that trail, El Prieto. And uh, plus we did Sunset Ridge. And we're gonna tackle San Mero next week. So it's gonna be a six, six session of three. So I'm just building up my way, trying to get some endurance, riding on Eco. So today we only use one bar all the way, which is pretty good. I think the, uh, the time stamps will tell you what's the uh, total mileage and total elevation, total distance. With that, see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.